What's going on everybody? It's the Bull Show, aka Aiden, and welcome back to another video. Ladies and gentlemen, today we've got a Chicago Bulls and New Orleans Pelicans injury update ahead of our game together in a couple of hours time. Now at the end of the day, there are some a bit of concerns about the Pelicans and some of their players and there's also some concerns about the Chicago Bulls players as well. But hopefully as a Bulls fan, all I really want to see is, I guess, a response from that last game against Denver Nuggets to this game against the New Orleans Pelicans. I'm hoping, I'm praying the Chicago Bulls can find a way not only to win the game, but to kind of, I guess, show everybody that it was a very bad game against Denver. We can't really take anything away from that, but it won't be replicated for future games to come. I hope we'll be able to do that, but obviously easier said than done. Before we get started, please like and subscribe to The Bull Show, turn notifications on, and let me know in the comments below your thoughts about the injury concerns and updates for the Chicago Bulls side of things, as well as the New Orleans Pelicans side of things. Not too sure how long this video is going to be, but nevertheless, let's start things off with the Chicago Bulls. Now, this is a bit of an interesting one because I don't believe the Bulls injury list has actually been updated from the last Denver Nuggets game to the New Orleans Pelicans game. So when you look at the injury list on ESPN, obviously when you look around Twitter and everything like that, there's not much updates around the Chicago Bulls, which means there could potentially, I think, be a possibility that Kobe White does return. But I'm going to go out on a limb here and say Kobe White is probably still going to be missing this game against the New Orleans Pelicans. Again, I'm waiting for that, uh, I guess, update to occur. Maybe it will occur when I'm asleep or something like that and the game actually kicks off. Maybe it's a game time decision. I'm not sure. But I do believe Kobe White is most likely going to miss this game against the New Orleans Pelicans, which I think is expected. If I had to take a guess about Kobe White's return, I would have picked the Orlando Magic game. It's in Chicago and obviously it's a couple of days after this Pelicans game as well giving him the absolute necessity the absolute most amount of time we could give him for that return we don't need to rush him back into anything and he's obviously not going to be traveling I don't think so a bit of an interesting one there ladies and gentlemen we'll have to wait and see how that goes but again that's just my guess I'm not too sure until that injury list is updated. I guess we're going to be left a little bit in the unknown territory with Kobe White. But if you're asking for my opinion and what I think about the situation, I do think Kobe White will most likely be out for this game. We got to look at the New Orleans Pelicans side of things, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not sure about the entire injury list, but there's obviously one key guy that could potentially be missing this game, and his name is Zion Williamson. Now, Zion Williamson has a day-to-day -day injury. He has a full contusion, and I believe the Pelicans had a game earlier today, and he actually did not play that game because of that full contusion. So it could potentially be resting him for back-to-back -back purposes or just a lot of games in quick succession, or maybe he'll be missing this game against the Chicago Bulls as well. But obviously, Zion Williamson being out is a big blow for the Pelicans. And that gives us a big opportunity to hopefully win this type of game away from home out in the West. I think you've got to take any sort of situation you can get. I don't wish injury on anybody. I don't wish injury on Zion. I don't wish any injury on anybody. And... I hope we get to see the best version of the Pelicans because we need to prove to ourselves that we can actually be some of these great teams and we need to also make a statement in doing so. So I'd want to verse the Pelicans at their best. So if we do walk away with a win in this game, if we fight well, we compete hard and we walk away with a win, no one can put any excuses on that win. So I really am looking forward to that game, but obviously you have to beat what's put in front of you. If the Pelicans decide they still want to rest Zion because it's still very young in the season and they don't want him aggravating any more injuries or getting injuries any worse than it needs to be. I can understand that from the Pelicans point of view, but obviously um, it is a minor injury from my understanding. So hopefully Zion gets well soon. Hopefully Kobe White returns soon. And hopefully the Bulls have a healthy team and we'll see what happens in the future. But those are the key guys, ladies and gentlemen, that I guess could potentially be missing this game against the Pelicans and the Chicago Bulls. Let me know in the comments below what you think about the injury updates for this game. And ultimately, what do you think of our chances to win this game? Again, I'm not necessarily asking them to win this game. Of course, I would love a win in this game. And I expect a win in this game as well, just by the response factor alone. But I want to see us compete. I don't want to see any more blowouts. I don't want to see lack of effort. I don't want to see players and coaches criticizing each other for how bad and how poorly they played or how hard we played or whatever the case may be. I want to see if we lose these types of games, which can very well happen. I want to be sitting here in the game reaction and discussing with you guys, talking about how hard we played, but unfortunately it wasn't meant to be. We walk away with a loss in a competitive battle. I don't want to talk about any more blowouts again. I know eventually it's going to happen, but I'm just hoping, I'm praying that we respond well. 
where to see what the outcome will be. Also, if you've stuck to the end of the video, I do actually have to make an announcement, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, there's a high possibility I won't be making the game reaction tomorrow at the times that you normally expect. I'll probably have to wait and make that game reaction a little, a little bit later towards maybe the time you're seeing this video now, just because I've obviously got other things to take care of throughout the day. Again, it might be right at night for you guys. It's in the middle of the afternoon for me when I've got to make those game reactions and sometime life does take over and you got to do certain things, I guess, throughout the day to get past the day and stuff like that. So yeah, that's kind of what I'll be doing uh, and that's kind of the announcement that I've decided to make now so thank you for watching please like and subscribe if you're new if you're wa wanting that game reaction it will still come ladies and gentlemen i'll try my best to never miss a game reaction even if it is a little bit delayed but of course uh you will be seeing that game reaction hopefully we'll still be talking about a win stay safe stay healthy stay tuned for more take care and peace